Good day. We will try a function test on MEB engine. Same in MEC, okay? But in our case, this is MEB. Same as MEC, okay? If you function test, do start preparation and follow the test. But for now, this is the logo of inside of the angle encoder tdc1 at 0 degrees okay the marker master a must be lit okay must be turned on okay okay for this one 0 dash 44 marker master a true okay that is the first thing at tdc1 but in our case, the function test is before TDC 2. Okay. My colleague, go to the flywheel side so that we can radio and then follow the steps. Just follow the steps and then that's it. Then we have a video, separate video, how to adjust and explain the internal of the angle encoder just just browse our playlist okay for this one meb almost the same on mec okay okay done do start and done if you have prepared assistant it means there is a man on the plywheel okay start means a test value a t f f 0 dash 4 4 it means same in dash 4 4 t f f f it means the flywheel is before uh, after tdc1 or exactly at tdc1 i call my colleague that put it back to before 2 degrees of TDC1. See, FF, FF. It satisfies the reference value. Okay, and then follow the next. I'm done. For 0 degrees, 0, that is the value, but in our case, that is before. TDC1. Okay, done. And reboot the system. The system will automatically reboot. Okay. Reference A. For that one, A. That is for angle encoder A. The reference B is the angle ring encoder B. Test value, okay. For the first step, and then next step reboot ccu after that after rebooting next step see the value is not correct you need to command the 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 people in the uh, the person that in assign in the I will say that turn the engine direction to 45 degrees after TDC1 so that it will satisfy the reference okay the value for that for this table you can see in that chart Okay, 47 degrees after TDC at cylinder 1. You need to tell the person assigned to the flywheel. Okay, angle encoder B must be 45 degrees at TDC 1. Must be true. Okay, you can see the reference. And the test value is the same. And then press done. 
Next, follow the next step, 92 degrees. Then, this one, I'll check, I'll tell my colleague that I need to check so that I can show you in the video. There is a pointer, after that pointer, the box that is connected to the angle encoder ah sorry TSA A master slave A that is pickup this pickup is not connected to our our encoder separate that is the separate circuit Okay, next. We need to satisfy that 92 degrees. 92 degrees after TDC1. Okay, as soon as they set after 92 degrees, correct value and then press done. And next step, 137 degrees after TDC1. Okay, the fine adjustment, same with the MAC. Need to get the trigger offset. Check the value. And then... The reference is correct and then press done then that's it setting of fine adjustment it means the main engine must be in running condition so that we can perform PMI zero diagram okay in the details you can see also the angle Okay, I'll show you the, the plate of our main engine, MEB, okay, six cylinder, okay, there is also TSA A and TSA B. That is our indicator, then the flywheel. Okay, this is our indicator, the pointer. At the top of the pointer, there is a box, there is a pickup. That is for our master slave A. That pickup that detects the semicircular ring that attach on the flywheel. Okay. That is TDC1 points to the pointer is pointing the TDC1 I clean so that we can point uh, make a stencil or mark so that I can show you in a video okay that is the marker where the TDC1 sets before TDC1, the TSA, TSA indicator must be turned off. Okay. We need to forward to TDC1. Set to TDC1, the TSA. A indicator must be lit or light up because that is TDC1 at 0 degrees that is the 
mark that we need to follow okay the top of the pointer that is the box then this is the circular ring in line to our reference master slave uh, marker slave a that is semicircular ring that attaches on our flywheel okay there is a pickup okay that's it If you learn from this video, please like, share and subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell for more updates. Also follow us on Facebook Barco TV. Thanks for watching.